same mural was unveiled in Sacramento's La Familia Maple Neighborhood Center today. The organization celebrated the completion of the mural that promotes education. We wanted to recognize the historical value of STEM itself. Science, technology, engineering, and math. We were trying to show that this element of, of processing of life has been existent in all your cultures. The mural is called STEM Rooted, showing how STEM has been embedded in cultures for centuries. Aztec and Mayan civilizations, they have the calendars, the pyramids, Stonehenge. Africa has the pyramids, the precision balance of China's yin and yang symbol. Those are the type of images that are seen throughout the mural to, to show uh, why I call it stem rooted, that it's it's here, it's been here, and it's going to continue today. Marco Sagiri hand painted this bright colored mural, spending the past two years designing and creating it. It was appreciated by the community watching this develop over over time in a, in a more methodical process. Growing up in the same community, he wanted to make sure to give back. The person who did it is also from the neighborhood, also someone who traveled the same tracks, went to the same schools, had the same challenges of temptation not to go to school or not to do these things, and yet here I am implementing something of a positive nature in the same community to, in, to be inspiring to the next generation. Right next to this mural was one that was painted in 2009 by another artist. It was part of an interactive project with the Maple Elementary School, which closed in 2013. Marcos connected the mural with the one he was creating. It's still an institution of us giving and offering goodness to the community, the students, the adults now that are here, the seniors that are here, and anyone else that uses this campus. That it had a foundation set with education and set with the mission of, of helping people succeed. And Marcos is also working on a mural museum on the WX corridor under the freeway. That's of uh, Interstate 80, Highway 50 there. And more work is expected this spring. All right, let's get